I want you to know that as we gather here in Santa Fe tonight, the entire state of Texas embraces you, supports you, and prays for this entire community. We are not here today and gone tomorrow. We're going to be here every day until we ensure that Santa Fe Independent School District and this school are put back in place and normalcy is returned to your schools and safety is returned to your schools. Did I understand life-changing challenges? As a person who, out of nowhere, one day had his life forever changed by an accident that left me in a wheelchair unable to walk again. I know the anguish so many families are facing today. Families ripped apart. Families that will never be the same again. What allowed me to rise up from having my life broken in half is the very same thing that will repair and restore the fractured families today. Reliance upon God, reliance upon the community with the drive and vision of hope that only Texas can provide. We, we can't claim to understand why these things happen, other than knowing that come before you right now understanding that somebody's in need of medical attention. Yes, Lord. Lord, we understand that you are the God that heals. We understand that you are the God that protects. Mm -hmm. Lord, right now I ask that you would bring healing and protection to this individual. Mm -hmm. We thank you so much for uh, the ability to call on you and know that you yeah. hear us. Yeah. Lord, give the wis wisdom to this medical staff that's attending to their needs. We thank you so much for it. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. This community tragically has seen the valley of the shadow of death. But this community will come through. And with the strength and compassion of the men and women here, and all of Texas stands alongside your side. God bless you. Bring back, bring back prayer. And so, God, in this moment, may you wrap your God-sized arms around them. God, may you put your peace and your comfort in them. And, Father, I pray for every student, the students that are here today, the students that are at home. God, we ask that you would wrap around them. Like, right now, I'm still really shocked that this actually happened. You would never think it happened to your school, but it would. A few months ago, there was popping noises, and we went on lockdown. That's the closest thing we had to a drill. So, as you can tell, running through my mind here right now, knowing it's real, has me just...